And I'm Justin Wilfon. It is finally back to class today for Oklahoma's largest public school district. Tulsa Public School students were the last in our area to return to school, getting things underway this morning. Back to school means increased hazards with more pedestrians and drivers out and about. Tulsa police increased traffic patrols in school zones to help lower the risk, but accidents can still happen. A student walking to school this morning was hit by a car. Two News reporter Brianne Palmerini joins us live from the newsroom with the latest on the accident. Brianne? Well, the good news is officials say the 12 year old received minor injuries and he is expected to be all right. Now, it happened just across the street from Jones Elementary, very nearly in a school zone. Now, police say the 12 year old boy was actually walking to Whitney Middle School where he attends class. They say when he attempted to cross the street, he didn't look both ways and stepped right in the path of a moving vehicle. And the driver will not receive a citation. The speed limit is 40 miles an hour on 15th Street where the accident happened just past the school zone. Police say while they are doing all they can to reduce the risk of accidents when students head back to class, they need drivers to stay alert as well. In this case, this child's a half a mile from his school that he's walking to. So we need drivers to be aware and slow down all around the city, not just in the school zones. Now, Tulsa firefighters were also stationed right down the street from the accident. They're parking near schools all week to provide another visible reminder for drivers to slow down. Live in the newsroom, Brianne Palmerini, 2 News works for you.